It actually fucking hurts. Oh, here come the boys. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Alana, and today I'm here with a video that no one asks for, but I decided to deliver to you guys anyway. No one gives a crap. But two weeks and a day ago, I went and got my septum pierced, which is this little guy in the middle of my face. I know that there's like thousands of these videos on YouTube already, but you know, like I just wanted to put my little bit in and just like talk about it, talk about mostly mostly <laughs> talk about the healing process for me so far and aftercare so to get started with this video so i've been wanting my septum pierced since i was literally i think 13 or 14 when i started getting into my emo phase because you know we know emos um, <laughs> like to have piercings to express themselves so i've been wanting one since i was literally about 13 14 and i'm now 18 so it's been a while and i've had plenty of time to think about it um actually at uni one day and i think i was meant to hang out with some of my friends after school except some of them bailed so i was like i kind of just want to get a piercing i want to be bold and brave <laughs> Ugh. and i was sort of debating whether to get a normal nose piercing or my septum and I was like you know what I'm gonna go for the septum because I don't know if some of you know but you can hide this piercing you can hide it by flipping it up and like if you don't want it you're not gonna see scar tissue if you take it out there's a lady walking okay anyway so it's every day bro so I went and um, got it pierced. I took my butt down to off your tree, which I'm pretty sure people have sort of like mixed reviews about. But I was like, you know what? They're having a sale on piercings at the moment. So if things are going to go wrong, at least I didn't pay much for it. And I just went on the Tuesday afternoon and I got it done. I was expecting it wouldn't hurt. And I have a pretty like high pay, high pain tolerance. I have a pain tolerance where it's like I can handle pain pretty well so I wasn't expecting it to hurt for me because people say that like it's the least painful piercing like they've ever had. Basically a septum piercing shouldn't hurt if it's pierced through the what they call the sweet spot which is like a thinner piece of skin between the bone in your nose and like the end of your nose and then you've got cartilage there and just mm. so I'm thinking that I may have had like a thicker sweet spot or something I don't know but the piercer did say I had lots of room to pierce so. The pierce to put the clamps on my nose to me like for some reason I didn't really feel the clamps which people say that usually feels a bit uncomfortable but I didn't really feel it so I was like cool this piercing is gonna go great so he starts to pierce it actually kind of hurt <laughs> it was probably like a three or four out of ten so like it wasn't too bad like it didn't hurt that bad it like kind of hurt why is that lady walking again back where did she go <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's because I was like, I don't know, I did get a hole in my face, I guess. So I'd probably say it was a 3 or 4 for me out of 10. Anyway, so it wasn't too bad. My eyes did water so much because, you know, it's connected to your eyes. I don't know, facial anatomy. So now here we are. I'm so thankful that I did sort of just like go and get this piercing. Otherwise, I probably would have put it off more. I love it so much. I think it suits me. Like so many people have said it suits me, which I'm really happy about because there's nothing worse than something not really looking right on you, I guess. Although it doesn't matter, do what you want to do. I was kind of like conscious about that being like, what if it doesn't actually look good on me? Then pointless, whatever. I'm going to get into like the healing and the aftercare stuff. It's been like two weeks and a day or so. The healing's gone fairly well. With healing for a septum piercing, it usually takes to fully heal about six to eight months. It's probably different for different people. I haven't experienced much pain at all with it. Like some people say when they like touch the tip of their nose, it hurts for the first few weeks. But mine like hasn't hurt at all. The only times I've like it hurts for me is when I am cleaning it to clean it um, all I do is I've been using the saline spray that was provided when I went and got it pierced all I do is spray this onto the end of the q-tip cotton tip whatever you want to call it spray it onto there once it's sprayed onto there I just I clean like this like I go around I'm giving kind of a bad example I just go around and I get all the little crusties off because you know it's in your nose you get a bit of crusty shit so when I'm cleaning Cleaning. I'm trying to example, but when I'm cleaning it, it does do that. Anyway, so um, as I was trying to say before, but I had to example it. So when it does that, if I push it back through, right, and I haven't cleaned it properly, like cleaned a crusty off, then it actually fucking hurts. So the jewelry is meant to go through the hole in your nose, obviously. But the crusty, if it's still on to the jewelry, it'll go through as well. And that shit fucking hurts. So that's probably the most painful healing experience I've had with this piercing. And usually you kind of do knock it a little bit by accident or get your 
your clothes caught on it when you're lifting your shirt up or whatever. But I actually haven't really had any problems with that. Maybe I'm just extra careful, like conscious, I don't know. But last night um, was the first time I knocked it like really bad. Um, I was in bed. I usually have both my arms under the covers and like kind of cocoon myself. And I tried reaching my hand out to like grab my phone. And I like went up and fucking mm, <laughs> I hit my nose. Anyway, so I'm going to wrap up this video. Hopefully I've covered the important things. But if not, if there's anything you want to know, just comment down below and let me know. And comment down below, let me know. <laughs> and then I should be able to answer them. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up because that's cool. And subscribe for more videos because I'll be posting weekly, if not a little bit more. Much love, y'all. Peace out. Tails, paint to nails, credit card flipping for a two dollar ring pop